Hello and welcome back to the Unboxers and today we have for you another awesome Tekken 8 figure and we want to say a great big thank you to Bandai for sending him to us for free to share with you today. Today's figure is it's king king so he is the second figure we've done from the game dimensions line uh that bandai does and these are really cool figures so uh, this is from um tekken 8 like we said um and um he has a leopard mask he does looks yes. like um but it actually looks like he has a little leopard head uh, yeah. up there um he does come with a couple extra hand sculpts looks like he wears um, a blue glove, you know, uh, fingerless glove on his left hand and a black one on his right hand. Um, and then you have the little fight yeah, sign right like there <laughs> across that. there. Um, so let's go ahead and turn the box around. It's got some cool artwork on the front. Ooh, and some cool um, shots from the gameplay um, on the back as well. And it looks like he's holding on to um, a snowball. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but I think it's not. that's a power effect, yeah. So very cool. All right, let's go ahead and get King out of his box and give you a much closer look. We'll be right back. All right, so there's King from Tekken 8. Out of his box. Um, let's go ahead and take, so here's the, like, fighting effect, right? Yeah. Is that what you called it? In the, look at that. It's like, um, it's like icicles hanging down. Yeah. But it can go on his hand right there. You can see the hole. In that part of it and then his fist fits in there right yeah and then you can see it looks pretty neat it's almost like he's throwing ice but very cool um, and now let's take a look at the two other hand sculpts so this is a like with one finger out they're both making the same like hey we're number one um, but the hand the hands he has on are closed fists so um yeah this the the closed fist is what would go in the um yeah in the power inside effect, yeah. the power effect and then the other ones you could have they could actually hold things let's go ahead and take a look at king so here's his leopard facial sculpt so it does look like um there's a head there's it's supposed to be a head below there but um basically this is his head wow yeah. the teeth and everything it looks so real that looks like more than a mask so it's got all the leopard spots and then it has the little you know mask where it goes all the way around like that look at the ears and the eyes that is awesome yeah the sculpt on it is really good that's really neat um and he does have a black glove on this hand like i said and a light blue one on this um other than that he has some purple and yellow and black going on um let's see a couple different color purples a little bit deeper purple here too as well and we were commenting how he looks like a wrestler yeah he definitely has a um, wrestling look to him yeah i can't tell if this is like gray or really pale lavender but anyway i think on the camera it's coming off um like more lavender but it does have a hint of gray to it it says his name on the side yeah so you always want your name on your That's pants right. so nobody tries to take them it says king right there and i like how they did the the um k in black and then the other in the yellow on opposite colors um he's got the laced up boots yeah he definitely does look like a wrestler he's got the knee protection going on and um elbow protection on that particular elbow but this one is without any protection so i'll go ahead and let you show off his articulation but look at that face <laughs> all right so he's gonna have articulation at the neck so he can look from side to side um you can see he has a point here so it will help him to look down um, slightly um, and also up a little bit. Um, he has articulation at the shoulders, so it will go 360 all the way around and extend actually up above T. Um, he has the bicep swivel, the dual elbows, so he'll have good articulation there. And then the, uh, the wrists are actually like on a ball joint, so they will kind of move all over the place kind of put them in whichever position you need he has two points in the torso one in the uh, mid torso uh, and it will kind of go forward and backward as well as rotate um, and then he has the ab crunch so it will crunch forward and rear backwards um, he has articulation at the hips 
and it will go side to side as well as front to back um, the tail is even articulated if you want to move that around uh, he has the dual knees and then the ankles um, will rotate and uh, pivot to help him to stay flat footed so it's actually I think these are on a ball joint as well so they can kind of pivot around as much on this joint there so um, really cool new Tekken figure and glad to add him to our Bandai collection all right so there's one last look at King from Tekken 8 we want to say another great big thank you to Bandai for sending him to us for free to share with you today thanks so much for watching as always come back and see us like subscribe and we will see you next time